Hello, and welcome to the McClellan uh, Data Center for Advanced Data Centers. What we're going to talk about today is the uh, right line uh, self-contained uh, heat containment system. Uh, what you see behind me is, uh, is the prototype version. This is our first uh, alpha build. Some of the uh, uh, specific points of this alpha build uh, I'll point out. One of the first things is the uh, removable blanking panels. These removable blanking panels allow you in 6 inch resolution to be able to accommodate uh, for 30 inch or 24 inch racks, uh, thereby being able to insert or take out a rack with ease and be able to maintain containment during that transition. Uh, additionally, some of, the thing, some of the additional features are on the top of the racks. Uh, we can uh, seal any of the gaps uh, with a uh, Venetian blind type of uh, plastic component that will uh, continue to maintain the barrier. Some of the other beneficial features are the uh, end of row doors. Uh, what's uh, specific about these doors is that they swing in and they also swing out. Uh, this is good for uh, uh, personnel protection to crash in and crash out as well as maintaining uh, some, uh, some pressure deltas. If you have excessive pressure in your uh, return plenum and the pressure is building, what will happen is one of the doors will actually pop out and uh, let air escape. Uh, if you have excessive negative pressure, rather than uh, forcing air to be pulled through your IT equipment, it can actually pull one of the doors in and pull in outside uh, in air in the data center. So that helps uh, your AC system uh, operate uh, at, a, uh, at a more efficient level. Some of the other features are uh, the above rack uh, blanking that uh, will accommodate for different height racks. Uh, this system will allow for any width, any depth, or in any height rack solution and be able to provide uh, a, a certain level of containment. The containment is meant to be uh, about 90 to 95 percent uh, uh, contained and figuring on 5 to 10 percent leakage. That leakage is really meant, uh, like the doors, to be able to uh, provide a pressure balance between the supply and the return side. Some of the other features is uh, this uh, unit is uh, completely expandable, meaning as you can see here it's set up for about uh, 10 or 12 racks, so 5 or 6 on each side depending on the width of those racks. But as you can see the structural features are designed so that this can extend down the row of a data center uh, and uh, be built modularly. Additionally, there's no, uh, there is no waste when you uh, uh, build onto this unit because everything is reusable. You just buy the interstitial frame and then continue to march down the data center, expanding your hot aisle containment as required. Some of the other features are a, uh, a clear ceiling. Uh, the clear ceiling uh, was done on purpose to allow ambient light. Uh, from around the data center to uh, penetrate the, uh, the hot aisle. And this is for working environment uh, to be uh, lit without additional lighting inside the, uh, the aisle. Uh, chimneys are provided. Uh, <clears throat> right now on this unit there's, there's physically just one chimney but there are positions for five. You can actually go up to ten chimneys if that's what you require for heat density and uh, to maintain the proper uh, CFM. And that pretty much concludes uh, our presentation for the right line heat containment system. Thank you.